Hello everyone, it's me Lucero again. So today I'm going to practice with you about the topic learn English or retired. So let's watch the video first before we are going to discuss with Mimi. Let's go. Learn English or prepare to retire. That's what the CEO of Japan's top online retailer told his employees today. By the year 2012, all employees of Rakuten will be required to speak English or risk losing their jobs. Japan's top online retailer plans to make English the company's official language, as a number of the nation's firms tell staff to go international or prepare to go home. Rakuten CEO Hiroshi Mikitani says he wants a world company, not a Japanese firm, and his staff must be proficient in English by 2012 or face retrenchment. Speaking at the company's earnings announcement on Thursday, Mikitani said Rakuten aims for 70% of revenues to come eventually from overseas e-markets, and that means everyone needs to speak English. Obviously, this is a uh, all company initiatives, not just uh, board level, just uh, management level. Uh, it's for every single person uh, in our company, uh, as far as they are the full-time marker. Auto giants such as Toyota and Nissan have announced moves to make English more a working language. While one auto parts firm has gone so far in Japan as to advertise for an English-speaking CEO. On average, Japanese have performed worse than almost any other nationals in English testing, tying with Tajikistan for 29th place of 30 Asian countries in a 2009 survey. Mikitani, who holds a Harvard MBA, says English is essential for a company that recently acquired U.S. online retailer Buy.com. Obviously, uh, some of the, our uh, members are struggling, but yet uh, their uh, English level and English skills are improving dramatically for the last six months. Rakuten also bought French Emol Price Minister in June for $246 million, while operating an online mall in China and planning to be in 10 foreign markets by the end of this year, speaking the international language of profits. Okay, good job. So now let's try to practice with Mimi. Here we go. So there are four questions. So let's get started to answer each question you would like to practice. So I would like to choose question. Mm, let me see, aside from English, what other language would you like to learn? Uh, I want to focus on English, so I will choose do you think English learning is important? Let's guess. Yes, I think that learning English is very important because without knowing about English, we could not speak and we could not learn something new from around the world. English is a common language, like an international language that we can use to communicate with everyone and learn something new from around the world. You will see the Mimi will give us the, some conclusion like this. English is in this a common language that allow us to communicate with people from different countries and cultures. It's open up opportunity for us to learn and connect with the world. So next question is, what do you think are some speci specific be benefits of learning English? Yeah, I would say that there are so many benefits of learning English, such as when you travel around the world with, uh, when you can use English, you can understand the foreigners, especially when you visit some country who are native speaker in using English, you can understand them and can also learn about their culture easier. And even you go to somewhere that is not English is not a native language, but you still use English because English is a common language. And when you go anywhere by traveling, you can practice 
and you can use English to learn more about their culture. And for the second thing, you can learn a lot of things from books and uh, watching international channels. Oh, it's too long. But uh, I think Mimi will make a conclusion for you to know how to make your voice clearly and transfer and express what you mean easier to understand. Let's see. I talk a lot, but a lot of things that I should note that. So here, learning English can greatly enhance our travel experiences by allowing us to communicate with local and immerse ourselves in different cultures. It's also opened up a world of the knowledge through books, international channels, and other resources so besides travel and accessing information, what other advantages do you think in learning English can bring? Yeah, so uh, in my country nowadays, a lot of people, especially for a younger learner, young learner who are trying to uh, practice and learn English a lot because they can uh, enter in uh, they can enter a famous uh, university when they are uh, uh, finish uh, their high school or they also can get a scholarship to learn in a famous university from around the world so almost so many different uh, so many different scholarships will uh, will give the condition how to say it would be very um, important to uh, calc uh, to calculate or how to say to evaluate the student based on their English levels. That is one of the factors to base on. So now English Proficiency is often a requirement for admission to renowned universities and for securing scholarships. This is a very valuable skill that can open doors to higher education opportunity and academic success. It's definitely an important factor to consider when evaluating students. So now you can see how Mimi can support us, right? So do you think there are any other reason why learning English is important? Let me see. Yeah, right now, you know, technology is uh, developed a lot. So I am teaching English and I'm learning English online and I can make friends from around the world. So when I can improve my English, I can meet and talk with a lot of people from around the world. That is a good way to help me to expand my knowledge, expand my um, relationship with friends from Wunhua. Some of my friends from USA, from the other country, when they visit my country, they connect with me to to get to get the support from me because we are all we are already know each other online before they come here into my country. That is a great chance to develop our relationship, I think, social relationship. So let's see how we can reply us. Absolutely. Learning English online has become more accessible with the advancement of technology, allowing us to connect with people from over the world. It's a fantastic way to expand our knowledge and form meaningful relationships with friends from different countries. Building social connection through English can be a wonderful opportunity for personal and cultural growth well set. So do you think there are any other benefits of learning English for building relationship, connecting with people from different country?
Of course, for my situation, there are a lot of benefits. For example, right now I am learning English. It's, it's good for me to improve myself. I also can connect with other teachers from around the world because uh, they have a lot of things that I can learn. And I also can connect with the students from around the world who are learning English. And I can also teach them because I, when I teach them, I will improve my teaching skills. And I also learning a lot of uh, a lot of new things from their cultures, from their uh, hobbies, from their habitats, and all the interesting new thing that is interesting. So that means I can expand my mind, open my mind to see the world in my point of view. So yeah, with different point of views as well. Learning English not only allows you to improve yourself, but it's also open up opportunity to connect with teachers and students from different parts of the world. This is a great way to exchange knowledge, learn about different cultures, and broaden your perspective. It's wonderful how learning English can expand your mind and enrich your life. Do you think there are any other ways that learning English can help self improvement and expand your horizons? I'm expanding my horizon. Mm, let's see. Yeah, uh, I think that um, when I improve my English, I can learn myself how to say self improvement a lot because. You know, when I have more and more connection, let's say uh, good connection, that means I will meet good people. So when I can good meet people, that means I can learn from them a lot of nice things. So, you know, always we are always looking for something new or something is better than us to improve ourselves. So if we are getting better, that means we can connect with a better person, better people. And uh, about... Horizons, I am not really understand about the expand my horizon, but as I know that uh, I can improve my uh, relationship with everyone, I think, and I can help a lot of people. That's a great perspective. When you improve your English and connect with more people, you have the opportunity to meet individuals who can incise, inspire and motivate you to become a better version of yourself. Building relationship with positive and supportive people can contribute to your personal growth and self-improvement. Additionally, expand my horizon thoughts learning English can help me again a broadened understanding of different perspectives and culture which turn can enhance my ability to connect with uh, and uh, help others. Good job. So that was a great discussion about importance of learning English and its benefits. So is there anything else you would like to add to any other question you have? So I think it's enough time for us today. Thank you so much, Mimi. And I hope to see you next time to practice English with you. And thank you so much for helping me to make a conclusion and help me to improve my speaking skill. See you tomorrow. Goodbye. So I finished my lesson today. So thank you so much, everyone. And hope you enjoy learning English every day like this. So. See you tomorrow. Goodbye, everyone.